Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, commonly known as ADHD, is a prominent disruptive behavioral disorder in our society today. The disorder has two main types, the inattentive type and the hyperactive impulsive type. This film will focus on the inattentive type. The inattentive type of ADHD in general terms describes behaviors such as being unable to have sustained attention concerning everyday and other tasks, the inability to avoid being distracted, and the overwhelming feeling to disobey rules. Other symptoms of ADHD include, but are not limited to, not able to pay close attention to details, not able to keep attention focused on tasks, doesn't listen when spoken to, does not follow instructions, avoid and or dislikes things that take a lot of mental effort for extended periods of time, and so on. Enter Bart Simpson, son, brother, student, neighborhood terror, devious little bastard. While Bart is the main focus of this video, it is important to know a little bit about his family and the history of their mental health. Homer Simpson, Bart's father, is accompanied by periods of forgetfulness and ignorance and also has a reported IQ of 55. Homer also displays regular instances of explosive anger. Marge Simpson, Bart's mother, is described as a happy homemaker. She usually spends all of her time there cleaning up and doing things for her family. However, she has shown some gambling addiction problems in her history. Lisa, Bart's sister, is a very intelligent young lady. She does not appear to have any limiting mental health symptoms. Maggie Simpson is Bart's infant sister. She doesn't appear to show any abnormalities for an infant. Abe Simpson, Bart's grandfather, suffers from some mental health impairments. He has trouble remembering history and also experiences problems recalling his past. Now that we've taken a look at the Simpson family, let's look at Bart a little more in depth. this machine. One prominent symptom of ADHD is the utter dislike for things requiring mental effort. This is very well demonstrated by Bart Simpson in an episode from season four entitled Marge Gets a Job. Books, children? It's time for your English test. Oh, sick on test day. Why? Why? Bart, have you ever read The Boy Who Cried Wolf? I'm halfway through it, I swear. Oh. So, Bart, how are you feeling? Can't complain. Well, then, you're ready for your makeup test. Oh, my ovaries. <laughs> Suckers. Have you ever read The Boy Who Cried Wolf? I glanced at it. Boy Cries Wolf has a few laughs. I forget how it ends. Bart, to avoid this test, you've had smallpox, the bends, and that unfortunate bout of rabies. Well, I'm not sure I'm over it. Shove it, witch! No more excuses. Another clip demonstrates Bart's inability to follow instructions. Bart Simpson to the principal's office. Post haste. <laughs> Bart, so good to see you. I have a little favor to ask you. I'd like you to give this note to Edna when you get back to class. I don't think I have to tell you. It's for her eyes only. Dear Edna, I want to another secret render. I hear reading. I'm 
got rocks. This clip demonstrates Bart's inability to stay on task. Jeez, look at this place. We gotta do something. Hmm, garbage angels? <laughs> Dad, I think I need some fresh air. Can I go to the park? Do I have to sit up? No. Knock yourself out. And finally, in what is probably the best demonstration of Bart's disorder, here is a clip from the episode Brother's Little Helper. Principal Skinner, what would you say is the most important firefighting tool? Would you say it's prevention? Oh, absolutely, Lisa. That and the sand bucket. What's that stuff? Why, this is retardant. <laughs> sure is. And what's that? That's called a hose lengthener. <laughs> you need one. No. Oh. What's this? Just read the label. It's a king size flamer. <laughs> Bart, will you go bother someone else? Look, a fire engine. Stop that. Help, help, fire. Helmet. Can't you do something constructive? Sure, I can do something destructive. It's not working. It just spreads the flame. Get the fire hose. Get the fire hose. What's it doing in the gymnasium? Yeehaw! Bart, have you lost your... <laughs> Bart Simpson! You've really done it this time. Yeah, it all kind of came together. Thank you for coming. Thank you for getting me out of work. I'll be blunt. Bart's latest escapade goes far beyond the realm of the hijink. Dear, now the floor is as good as new. <gasps> My sport goggles! Your son is a ravenous demon. Relentlessly gnawing at all that's good and true. <laughs> yeah, he smells all right. But worst of all, he drags down the grades of anyone who sits near him. Just look at this pattern. Hey, that looks like Bart. And turning to the 3D map, we see an unmistakable cone of ignorance. Put it away, put it away. Very well, but there's no escaping the truth. Bart has a classic case of attention deficit disorder. You mean like John Leguizamo? How should I know? The point is ADD makes children restless and easily distracted. Hi, Marge, it's me, Homer. <clears throat> what, time to go? Please, Mr. Simpson. <laughs> And so, it is true indeed that young Bartholomew J. Simpson is a classic example of a child with ADHD. Although Bart's behavioral problems are comical on the show, they are very real in real life. While Bart seems to be a normal child in many ways, and he certainly is, he is totally unable, at times, to control himself and his behavior, which is what makes attention deficit hyperactive disorder such a problem for children like Bart and families like the Simpsons.